Yeah. Back out. You just cross this stream of death. So back in the Cheviots on a Friday night after work and it's glorious weather. Look at it. This is glorious weather. There's some big clouds building up over there. But the forecast says it's gonna be a nice night. Clear skies. See what the moon comes up like. We might get some uh, aurora like last week. Or we might not. I think there's some dead bodies up here, dead people. But I'm out with my mate from a few weeks ago when I did the camp at the Air Museum. There he is, Derek. I'll read. Where are you? Are well, you back out? I am back out. Can't say back, back out. Don't say back out. I, I've returned. <laughs> I've returned. <laughs> Don't you say back out. Ever. Nobody says back out. Anyway, I'm just joking. I'm just messing about. So I think we're going like somewhere over the back of here. In the middle of nowhere. We're in Scotland to be fair. So yeah. So we're going to press on. And just see how we get on. It's uh, actually beer o'clock. Six o'clock. What a place. It's the place of dreams. And then we're heading on a bearing of 631 degrees, 0.97, up to that one there. But we've got to go up there, up to that, and then the back of it and then down and up to the top. So it's quite uh, further than we think, further than we first thought, but that's all right because we've got lots of uh, lots of daylight left, which is always good. Like I said it before, these, these light nights make things better. And it's such a nice night as well. There's no rain, there's no wind, it's mint. It is mint. It's about time, like, isn't it? Only, only negative, if you can call it that, is that northerly wind is still chilly, you know? But not when you're walking. It will be when I stop. I put my coat on when I stop. So, yeah. That's it. Well, it's all gone wrong. That's the Scotland side. That's the England side. This is the border. This is where Rabbi Burns used to patrol in his kilt and his rifle. But we are going that way. The English side, no! That's not legal. It's highly illegal. Thought we'd be coming in Scotland, but we're not. Not to worry. There's like views like that though. Man, this couldn't have worked out any better. It's mint. Compared to what I'm used to. <laughs> Check them in the Maldives. <sighs> Listen. Ah, oh, over that way. So we'll go up this path here onto what that's called Eccles Cairn. And then the next one's Cole's Mouth. You know, I don't mind giving it away, because if you can find that, then you're obviously a proper walker. You know what I mean? We've had to use a map to find that, because we were actually heading that way. But, I mean, Derek's been here before, so he probably knew where he was gone. But I was just trying to be clever. <laughs> I was just trying to be clever with my map. The big cheese with my map. So yeah, we'll crack on through this gate. Here we go. We're in England. This is England. It's already cold here, isn't it? It's cold. As soon as you come through that gate. Right, and then we're going up here. Woo! Eccles Cairn. Not Eccles Cake. Eccles Cairn. With that view behind it. Look at that. 
So that's Scotland over there. This is the English side, which is still just as nice to be fair. Whew. Look at that man. We're remote here, like. It's not a single person about. Mm. Listen to that. <laughs> so we're going to go across there to the right of them trees and then up to the top of there. That's the last bit. Kirk Yetham. Yeah. Could be, eh? Uh, is it that far away? Aye. Christ, you've, you've bionically come up here. Trying to kill me. Ran up. Aye. Didn't worry, it's killing me and all. Or even the technical know how, of course. If there is a. If you slice you under the northern lights, I'll try and get some. There's the two cans. Much in the way that I said to my mum and dad, try and be a good man. We've got the first can over there. And the second one over here. So we'll tap out. And then we'll have to find somewhere to pitch. Bit bumpy, innit? Uh, Bit lumpy bumpy. I'm sure we'll find somewhere. <laughs> oh. Tap out. Here we go. We'll place on the top, we'll place this wooden cross. As a mark of our love for Jesus. Jesus Christ, the baby Jesus. So if you've lost the wooden cross, there it is. That's it, we're up. Yes, we're up. Whew. Now, to find a spot out on the floor. Keep the battery warm in there. So, we are at the top of the hill, as you've seen. And also, we're now syrup. So that's my tent there. I've got the Whistlux Lorry 2 which I think has been recalled. I don't know, I've never had a problem with it like, but apparently they're not happy about it. So I might get a new one sent, don't know, not sure. I think they're gonna put a four season in it, in it like a solid mesh. We'll see, Derek is in the tent of the moment. The little bobcat. Why I the little pussy cat? Yeah. Isn't his little pussy cat? Look at all these cozy gear. It's lofty, isn't it? Oh yes. Nice. Mice. Some beers. A couple of beers. Not too many. <laughs> I've got the whiskey as well though. Oh, I didn't mention whiskey. I can't drink whiskey. You know what happens. Oh, yeah. well, we're miles away from a river. I'll still end up in it. <laughs> I'll still end up in it. <laughs> I'm not selling anything tonight, so this is my setup. Got the Quasar three season bag. I hope it's gonna be warm enough. It's massive in there, like. Now I've got um, oh, a few beers there. This is Waski, this is not a, a, a piss bag, this is Waski. <laughs> oh, couldn't imagine it, couldn't imagine it. But I forgot my gloves, right, so I've got my hand warmers. These are mint, these hand warmers, red hot. Fancy forgetting my gloves though. And what else, did I forget, what did I say? Um, no, I didn't bring that on purpose. Uh, forgot my gloves and uh, something else. Can't remember. My bike. <laughs> that, was, <laughs> that was last week, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, jacket. 
Oh God, I'm a waterproof coat. Well, which turns out I didn't need, but you know, I still forgot it. I've lost it actually. Don't know what I've done with it. So yeah, there's the tent set up. And because it's eight o'clock neat, I'm gonna crack a beer open and toast this wonderful night with no wind, lovely sunshine and good company. Good company for a change. I'm normally on my own because I've got knee mates because everybody hates us. So just enjoying watching the sun going down. Just died into the clouds, didn't it? But that's all right. It was still nice. Tent standing firm there. It's a bit chilly though. A bit of a chill in the air, but it's not too bad. I can handle it. Oh, Bob cut there. So how was the night going? Absolutely fantastic. Uh, good, aye. Aye. Brilliant sunset. It's our first wild camp. Well, real wild camp. Yeah. Yep. You might remember, I don't know if you watched me and Derek at the um, Sunderland Aircraft Museum a couple of weeks back. Didn't get many views that. People go and watch that. It was good. It was a good laugh. We didn't get drunk at all. No, not a bit. We really did. They were just chilling out with the... That's my view there, look. Nice, eh? Gonna get the burgers on in a minute. Got burgers. Back on the burgers. A bit of cheese. I've got some nice cheese to go on them. But don't let him fool you about his fitness, because he says to me, I'm not fit, I'm not fit. We've raced up here, absolutely raced up here. Although it doesn't seem very high, we've raced up here. Oh, nearly killed us though. Mm. I know what else I forgot. What? And one of me, one of my subscribers is gonna love this. I've forgotten the Frenchie's mustard. Oosh. Oh man. <laughs> so it's gonna be just Burgers and cheese. Oh, I forgot the bloody Frenchies, man. <laughs> I want to know who this this subscriber, Christ Sauce. What? You know who you are. Anonymous subscriber, you know what I mean? Always comments, I don't know. I don't even know who this person is. Because <laughs> I always get grief. <laughs> I love a bit of criticism. Love it. Ah, right, anyway, so. Just gonna finish this beer and then I'll get the pan on. The old pan. No, no, you, can't, you can't steal people's catchphrases. Oh dear. Ooh, the grass is on fire. The grass is on fire. So we've got, we've got the burgers. Buns. Just to make sure. It's cooking over there. I thought you were filming. Yeah? I thought you were filming. Are you? No, I thought you were. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Just talking to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> it's gone, he's lost it. Oh, do you know what? I'm setting the friggin' grass on fire here. Yeah, uh, so it's not ideal because the wind's blowing the, the gas out a bit. Uh, I haven't got anything to make a wind break either, so. Might help. Get that heat up. Yeah, yeah, anyway. Get the burgers in and the cheese, and we'll come back when we've got things operating. Right, I'm just uh, cooking the burgers, taking ages because the wind's blowing the uh, the gas. Just seeing what Derek's up to. What are you up to? Oh, well, I've actually cooked some oh. noodles. I pre-chopped some red and white, uh, red and white, red and green peppers. Mm -hmm. I've added some chicken. Mm -hmm. I was going to add the pepperoni, but I've actually I've filled the pan a bit. I've like. filled the pan a bit. Aye, uh, but I might actually, you know, in the in the famous words of your your friend, mm -hmm. I might actually get a sturman, sternum thermal intercline or chest warmer. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Is it time? Is it? It's, it's time for a little chest warmer. Right. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna get copyrighted, like chucked out of YouTube. Yes. Uh, so I like your little uh, camp lights. Yes. It... 
camp being the operative oh, word. Gonna see that. Nah, you know, <laughs> each to their own. Yes. Whatever. Whatever. Mm. I've heard about you. I know all about you. But I'm just sitting waiting for these burgers to cook. Look at this. Andy, I'm going to sound like really, really naive to the area. Can you see that mast? No. Nah. Oh. Ah, yes, I do know that. I do know what that is. I really don't. There's, there's more than one. Is there not the wind tower thing? <laughs> um, I don't know. I'll have to get me burns. Because it's Scotland, right? That could be the uh, the one that's near Criffle. I don't know, maybe too far away. But you can see from the Lake District, right? In the Northern Fells. Mm -hmm. There's two masts over that way, so it might be them. I don't know. Could be just making that up, like. <laughs> but I could, I could be telling the truth. Well, the thing is, the kids are doing history at school at the minute, and I said the best person to speak to about history in Northumberland, round the hills, and mm -hmm. that is yourself. It is me, uh -huh. because I know all about the Roman Bronze Age, Bronze Age temples, <laughs> which were made in the Iron Age. Which is a, a parallax, a parallax in itself, a juxtaposition, if you like. And they were all burial chambers. And they used to bury them standing upright, you know. Aye. So there was more space for them. Because you think about it, there was a lot of people killed in them days. Aye. And put them somewhere. And they stood them up like a terracotta army. So that's it. I'm gonna turn this off now because I'm talking rubbish. Remember that? Okay. Cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers. Doesn't sound good, does it? I'm gonna turn that off because I'm scared. I'm scared of the gas. It sounds like the it sounds like the sizzling's coming from over here. Mm -hmm. I'm really scared. <laughs> I, don't what, I don't know what to make of that gas. Anyway. Cheese bad gas. Lovely laddie. Lovely. So we'll have these. And then we'll uh, we'll just wait for the northern lights to appear. Oh yes. Yeah, I don't know if it'd be northern lights. Dunno. I've had no alerts, you see, so I think maybe a bit hazy, hazy or cloudy. We'll find out. Right, so, oh, it's really chilly, but you know, we're loving it. Forgot my gloves. Forgot my gloves. So, how or are you doing? Absolutely massive. Uh, sorry, that's you. Uh, no, I'm brilliant. Oh, I'm, I'm absolutely massive. brilliant. I'm having the Chest warmer. All right, the chest warmer. Go on, and what is it? Oh, well, I can smell plastic. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's uh, it's called you gold gold label. I think it is. is it? It is. Ah, oh, it is. I like a bit of card hue, like Ooh. very nice. I'm not much of a whiskey connoisseur, to be honest. Do you want to do a little whiskey review? Or what? I will do. Yeah, right. Getting the beacon. I've got a massive Roman nose. Getting the beak in there, I can smell cinnamon. Cinnamon. I can smell toffee. Toffee. And it is like almost like a burnt, but a creamy sort of burnt. Yeah. Anyway, that's enough of this. <laughs> Let's get on with the tasting. Come <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And oh. then, yeah. Yeah. I can get like an oaky. Oak. Yeah. Like an oak, like a, a saged oak, old English. Um Welsh uh dresser. Oh. <laughs> Welsh dresser. <laughs> when it gets wet. Yes. And it, it's got like a, a ring tone of um It's got a ring piece <laughs> of, of something. Of, of something really like yesterday. It's got Three ways from Wednesday on a um, nowadays it's really um Does it remind you of Vernon Kay's hair? Yes. Does it? Yes, really. Well in that case, Aye. I've I sampled that as the beer 
I've had the same kind of beer. Brilliant. It's like the past, isn't it? Yes, it, it's a reflection of yeah, what yeah. could be. Oh, I think it is. Aye, definitely. But apart from that, right, is it nice? It is absolutely fine. Do you know what it is? Honestly, when I see in the box, I thought yeah. that's going to be one of them single malts that I'm not really keen on. Mm -hmm. And when I opened it, bear in mind, I, I paid 50 quid for this the other day. And I thought, I'm going to keep that for like a birthday. I opened it for this occasion, and I'm glad I did, because it's a very, very nice drop. Good. Very nice. Good. Hey. Is it rough and smooth at the same time? It's rough and it's smooth and it is definitely reflections of uh, Eden. Oh, it's the wrong one, man. It's me. It's me stormer bag. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you piss that satchel. Nice. Lovely, lovely. Yeah, <laughs> that's what, yeah, like workman's satchel. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Mm. I've got a confession to make. Well then. I drank it weeks ago. Uh-huh. And that is actually literally my piss bag. It's very nice. When I was in the forces, mm. I actually drank a lot of wee-wee. Uh... What were you in? Were you in the paras? No. <laughs> That's what they do, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Daily. <laughs> in Fort well, I'm not Bear grills, but... Uh... Um, in the forces, we're regularly. I shouldn't say that, you know, because we're heroes. Oh, we're, well, you are heroes. heroes. We're heroes. I'll get it. Hold on, I'll get in. We're heroes. Oh, I could have been. A, oh, I would have been the best soldier, man, like ever in the world if I had just if you signed that. If I just signed that document, I would have been in. But I bottled it at the last minute. You would have been an absolutely fantastic soldier. Yeah, you know? I would have been dead within weeks. I was. I would have been in the Falklands. Your navigation skills, apart from that's the, how long ago I nearly signed up. I would have been to the Falklands if I'd signed up. Aye. See, Mate. that's another thing, you know, you, 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 can, uh, you can add that to your reflective uh, life story, the fact that uh, you are young at heart, but you also, it really knocks me, the fact that my wife, when my wife met you on the Holy Island that time, that I was there with him, by the way, but, um, <laughs> what happened? <laughs> she turned around and she goes, he's lovely, I'm like, where do you know him from? I go, he's oh, from work. She goes, oh, he seems a lot long, younger than you. A lot younger than you? Yes. Younger than you? Yes. yes. I'm not going to give anything else away. Yes. Oh. Yes. Yes. Uh, anyway, that's enough of you, right? Yes. Yeah. Get me in, get me in. Me. It's me. <laughs> uh, anyway. No, what a good night. Um, it's a good lad, Derek Lake. He's all right. I notice how I get on well with people. He does. I just get on with everybody. He's an le absolute I legend. And all the people that like give us negative comments on my videos on YouTube, I don't mind that. I like it. I like it because partly, partly because I don't care. But the other half is you're probably right. <laughs> 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 yeah, you're just a drunken idiot. Well, I yeah, you're right. Head torch. Head torch where? Big torch. Wah! Wah! Doing in the belly. Oh, I can't see it. Uh, it might be I. Anyway, what we're looking at now, you can't see, is lots of stars. All the stars are out. So we're going to get the couple of beers drunk. I'm gonna, I've got a little chest warmer. We're going to turn the camera off. And I'm going to put it out overnight and see if I can get any stars. So... Yet again, right? Again, if it's there, if the time lapse is there, it worked. If not, it didn't work. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. That's brightening. Aye. And that's all right. Let them, let them go. They're miles away. We're thinking that the moon is going to come up over there. Mm. Over there, big moon. Right. Anyway, yeah. So we'll see you in the morning, now. Indeed, yes. Got I wouldn't on. care. It's honestly, it's like a painter's radio up there. It's absolutely lit and with star. I hope it, it does good. come out it's for you. It's like. a nice dark sky in it. Right. I just hope that moon doesn't rise and ruin it all. Morning. Campers, what a night, 
what a night. It's now quarter past nine and we're just rising from our graves. He hath not risen yet. Lo, I hath risen. Like some kind of zombie. <laughs> and I, good night. Talked a bit of nonsense. Had uh, had a big willy off. <laughs> I will not like. <laughs> uh, just then looking at these hills here. What a place to wake up to. Morning views. What a place. That's the east coast over there. This is the north. Ooh, fly just went in my ear. That was weird. This is Scotland. Welcome to Scotland. So yeah, and they get a kettle on. A nice brew. Slept well, like slept really well. A comfy mat. Sleeping bag kept us warm despite the frost. Did have my coat on like, but it's still alright, you know. So yeah, got the, got the kettle. Oh bye. Going back to bed for an hour. Anyway, this is what I've walked to. There we go, flattened grass. One day I'll get a decent flat pitch like. I've just thought, you know, I've got a perry whistle on there, but I've got one on the buckle. Ah, they're everywhere. Whistles yeah. everywhere. Yeah. Anyway, did you enjoy that camp? Absolutely thoroughly decent. <coughs> now the best bit about it, apart from the obvious company. Mm -hmm. Last night when we come up here, I was expecting Frost, rain, everything, and look at them on. absolutely uh, fantastic. The weather gods were smiling down on us Definitely. last night. did get frosty like. Uh, the cans were frozen when I looked this morning. But that's it. We had a good time. Talked a bit of rubbish. <laughs> Just doing a last look around here. We left no traces. I said fight at the grass last night, right? But can you see where? No. You've got to be so careful with your stove. This is like consumer advice, you know. It's long grass like this, and if it's dead dry, oh man, it can turn bad in seconds. So I suggest bringing a table <coughs> in the summer. I think I'll start bringing a little table to put the stove on, because that was bad. Luckily, I put it out. I just let it burn out. But there's no trace of it anyway. There's no signs that I did burn the grass. <coughs> It'll grow back. So we're heading off that way, past the two cairns, down the hill, and around, and we're coming over there somewhere, back into Scotland. Yeah, anyway, we're going. We'll just do it to Scotland. That's how it works, isn't it? Right. So if you're ready, Aye. I'm ready. Jump in. Let's get. Let's make like a tree and get the hell out of here. As Dolly Parton once said, "Down, down, deeper and down." <laughs> 